What's up, guys? Uh, good morning. It is like 6 a.m. I'm about to make coffee. I just made my coffee, but I'm about to actually set it up. Uh, today's video is going to be just not really an installation video, but uh, installation of like watching me do. Okay, yeah, watch me do the uh, tail lights that I got in yesterday. They're right here, and they look super nice. I posted a TikTok about them yesterday, and I'm excited to see them on the car. So, uh, let's get ready for the day, and uh, I guess you guys can see me at work, because these are, um, I'm going to do them during my break. They shouldn't be hard. The instructions were over here, but I dropped them. Oh yeah. The instructions are right here. Ugh. And it pretty much just takes the old wiring harness off of your, the uh, uh, OEM headlights and you just plug everything in. So here is the, uh, da, 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 where that? Yeah, you should just be able to take the old wiring harness and plug it into this and everything else should work out pretty well. So we're going to see. I hope that's it. Um, and then you have to put in the switch for this side, but not that side. So we'll find out and see how hard this is. I'll give you guys an update when I get it all done. All right, let's get uh, to work. All right, so got everything ready. Um, I'll tell you. All right, so I got everything ready to get my coffee. Uh, I had to, I have to drink coffee every day. It's that bad. Um, <clears throat> yeah. So let's get the tail lights in the car, and I should probably take the trash truck because they're coming today. So let's do that real fast, and we'll be all ready to go, and we'll head out. Do it. <sighs> you guys are gonna get a uh, little morning pool. Because I don't think I've uh, actually turned my car on. I don't think I've turned my car on on the uh, channel. So this is the morning uh, turn on. Let's see what we got here. It's not that loud. It's nice. Pretty reasonably respectful. But yeah, uh, it's cold here in Florida. Um, I know that's kind of weird to say, but it feels cold here. It's like 30 degrees here. So yeah, that's pretty cold. Ugh. We got those going. Let's try that again. Got it open. Ugh. And let's go get the taillights. And I need to get my gym back because I'm going to the gym tonight. So, yeah. Let's grab those, that. Take the trash out front. And then we'll be all good to go to work. Fun. So, I need you. And I need you. And come over here. Maybe, yeah, there you go. Da, 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 da. And try not to scratch or break these. Would be very nice. See which one of this? So, yeah, that's what we're looking at. That instead of that. I think they're going to look super cool. I'm really excited for them, so. Let's go. And so I'm not going to record the rest. I'm going to get my gym bag right here and then take the trash out because that's the board with the box and that was the gaming desk. Um, get that stuff in and get that stuff in the car, get that stuff outside by your curb and you guys are going to see me uh, drive to work and then we'll be there around lunchtime. I'll be putting the Ted Light tail lights on. So peace out guys. And we are here at work, so I'm gonna go see you guys. All right, what's up, guys? At work, so uh, we're gonna do this morning because no one's here, pretty much. So we got the tail lights right here. Let's pull them out and see how this is going to look. So this is this side. Set that right there, and set this over here. Those are gonna be pretty clean on the car. Uh, I'm gonna set you up on the side. Uh, I'm gonna use my GoPro and we're gonna get some uh, time lapse. Of, let's see how hard this is. It shouldn't be that bad. Like I said, it should be plug and play. You just gotta take the actual housings out of the old one 
and take the wirings out. So after that, everything should just fit perfectly fine. So wish me luck and let's see how it goes. All right, so I have to take a minute pause because we got some web appointments that came in. So what I got right now is I have the old housing out. I have the new housing. I'm putting their wiring harness in, following the instructions that they gave. It was really easy to take out. It was just three bolts to take it out. It's one, two, three bolts to take it out. It's going to be one, two, three bolts to put it back in. So that's pretty nice. The only thing I have to do now is I have to wire it back in. After I figure out this first one, the next one's going to be really easy because this one has the switch. This one's not going to have a switch for the, uh, the, the uh, what are they called? The trunk. So yeah, let me go do my job actually and then I'll be back to finish this. All right, hey guys, we're back and we're finally going to get this done. I had to stop because of work. It got busy and now we're at the evening time so it's not going to be a lot of bad people. But I want to show you, I did get one side in I think it looks awesome. I like that it's like one surface, and I actually do enjoy this like fan, like this fan shape right here. It's pretty cool. So let's see what we got. Let's open this up. So we took all this out, and we used the same harness as the old one. So now we just got to do the same to this side. Um, honestly, I'm not going to set up a time lapse. I already saw you already saw the time lapse for the other one getting all put in. So we're just going to finish this one out. Uh, get it out of here, and then I'll show you the final product when it's done. What's up, guys? It had been a few days later, uh, but we finally got the headlights on and installed. Uh, both of them are good. They're running. We had a few, a little problem with reverse lights. Uh, could have been a multiple of options. I personally think that the reverse lights I had in were still the OEM ones because they had the uh, Nissan logo and everything on them. So that probably was right, what was the reason they were burning out. So we just put in new ones and they are perfect good now. Um, other thing that was not a problem, it was just, I saw a little bit of it, so that's something I'm going to be looking out for. There's condensation. Uh, the first time I turned them on, I didn't even drive anywhere. I just turned them on and I had condensation. I don't know why that is. Um, it's just something I'm going to have to look out for. I know it's something that can happen when you put in headlights or taillights and if they're not sealed properly. So I just gotta watch out for that. But we got them on, so let's go show you guys what they look like. Cause I personally think they're pretty damn cool. I'm glad I did this. It like uh, the goal of this was to make it a little more newer looking, and I think it did it. I think the taillights are awesome, so let's go get that done. And we're gonna go outside and look at them. So we got the shoes on, let's go grab the keys, and let's go outside. Oh, okay. Ooh, it's cold. Yes, I'm in Florida and it's cold, because look at that, there's ice all over my window. Oh, what a shame. But first, before we start it, let's just look at the tail lights. So that is what we got. I personally think they're super nice. Like I said, there is some condensation right here the first time I put them on and the first start we had. But now there's not much, um, not really anything I see at least. So, yeah, let's get a good look at this. Again, I enjoy it a lot. I think they're super nice. Um, yeah, there's nothing really I would change with it. The installation was really easy. Uh, honestly, taking off the wiring kit. Like the first time was kind of hard, but the second time I did it was super easy for the other one, so that was nice. But let's get a start. Uh, and let me turn on my lights. And I'm gonna put on my uh, hazards, just so you guys see what the uh, turn signal is. So this is what we got right here. So I think that looks really nice. You have the fans, these fans that are red, your turn signal this is your reverse light so I think that's pretty nice and then you have your parking indicator right there so yeah I enjoyed a lot um, nothing I'd really change with it honestly I think they're they did what I wanted I wanted a new surface um, one thing I will say to note it I would to like be cautious of is I put in wanted smoke bites and these aren't smoked um, apparently I, I read through some of the comments through some of the comments and that is a constant problem that they have is that some people ask for smoke lights and they don't get them so 
just be aware that if you get these headlights, these tail lights, you may not get the actual smoke lights. Now, in my case, it's not that bad. I know someone that can wrap my my tail lights anyways, and I plan on wrapping my uh, side mirror. So we're gonna do that then. But just be aware um, that sometimes you don't get the smoked ones. However, even though they're not smoked, because they have the dark housing, the dark housing around it, it looks pretty dark at night. Um, so I am going to smoke them though just a little bit because I want them to match these up here. And these are the Spec D, and you can see these are definitely smoked. So the goal is to get them to match, and I am kind of blacking out some of the cars. Uh, I do have plans to wrap the other, the rest of the car a different color, so that's why I don't want to go too far with it, but yeah. Um, speaking about plans, the next video is going to be about my dynoing. We're going to get the car on a dyno. Uh, Emerald Coast Motorsports uh, is going to give me a tune. So to get a tune, you have to get a dyno first. So we're going to see what we're pushing right now and then what we're going to be pushing later in horsepower. I don't know. Um, I probably got like maybe 10, maybe 15 more, uh, 15 more uh, horsepower per on the car so I'm saying I'm probably at like well, uh, maybe 300 because like if I'm not mistaken 290 is stock for the automatic so let's see what we got um, but yeah so I hope you guys enjoy this video uh, if you want to follow the journey of the G please put us uh, turn that subscription down there turn it red to uh, turn it into the color, I forget what it's supposed to be, I apologize. But yeah, like the video and stay tuned, guys. I will see you guys in the next video. It'll be coming around uh, after the New Year's. So for everyone, I wish you guys a happy New Year's. Please be safe during this holiday. I know people drink. Um, if you're under 21, don't do it. But if you're over 21, please be safe, treat responsibly, and have a great day.